Hey Jason, how's it going? It's going well, Lee. Uh, so why are you coming to the Free State Project Liberty Forum? So uh, I drove with uh, about nine other people in uh, what's called libertycaravan.com. Uh, they consisted of people who were going to check out the Free State Project uh, in New Hampshire for the first time, and then actually some people that moved uh, are, are going to move and then, like build homes and like build a life here. So. Uh, I uh, did some videography along the way, uh, documenting their trip from California to uh, New Hampshire. So uh, that and there's just a bunch of my favorite people are here at the uh, Liberty Forum. Now, since you say you're, some of your favorite people are here, are, is there any specific uh, speakers that you're looking forward to see or any events that you're looking forward to go to? Um, so many. I mean, Brad Spangler, Angela Keaton, um, uh, Charles Johnson. Uh, I mean, I'm going to leave a lot of people off and then, of course, uh, Liberty Caravan is going to be presenting a panel. So. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a great time. Look forward to it. Now, what, what have you been working on uh, recently? Um, so we just concluded the uh, Motorhome Diaries, and uh, my next uh, my next project is I'm going to be going to Florida for the Fully Informed Jury Association. Uh, I'm going to be doing some uh, community organizing for them down in uh, Fort Lauderdale. Awesome. Thanks a lot. That's uh, wonderful. Uh, so why are you at the Free State Project? I'm here with Silver Circle Movie. Um, we're producing an animated full-length film um, about the economic collapse. And it's a thriller romance, so it can definitely reach into the mainstream, as well as entertain our libertarian community. And is, is this your first time at the Free State Project? Um, this is, I've been at Porkfest. Oh, okay. So, but, and uh, Silver Circle has been at a few Very cool. When, when can we hope to, to see uh, this? Well, we are hoping the projected date is spring 2011. Okay, thank you. How's it going? So, uh, why are you at the Free State Project? Well, uh, this is my third year here, uh, and my, uh, my first year coming here for uh, the full weekend. And uh, I got into uh, the Free State Project, I was living down in Massachusetts. And uh, I just got psychologically pushed out of Massachusetts. Uh, but this is about 10 years ago, and uh, I, w I moved, actually moved up here just before New Hampshire got selected. Okay. So, uh, but, uh, but anyway, there's just such an awesome feeling here of commitment to liberty and passion and intelligence, uh, all at the same time. Uh, and just is, there any, is there any speaker you're hoping to see or any event you're, you're really looking forward to? Yeah, well, you know, I, I really dig the novelty of, of, of finding things that I've never seen before. Um, but obviously, Judge Napolitano's... Uh, the big headliner here, but um, but yeah, I guess nobody in particular, and everybody in particular. Thank you, appreciate it. Yeah. And uh, why did you come to the Free State Project Liberty Forum? Why did I come to the Free State Project? Well, I'm, I'm asked, was asked to be a speaker. I'll be speaking on freedom and feminism. Okay. I'm a vendor for a group called Antiwar.com. Okay. And uh, besides uh, you speaking, are there any other events or speakers you're looking forward to see uh, this weekend? You know, a lot of these people are longtime friends of mine, so I look forward to seeing and hearing them all. They're usually people who are committed to nonviolence and non-aggressive foreign policy. Okay, thank you. So uh, why did you come to the Free State Project? Yeah, I, I came to the Free State Project because, you know, the everything that they were talking about just made more sense and, it, you know, it makes sense to to do, to, you know, to feel what you want to feel and do what you want as long as you, you're not harming anybody else and to work towards that end, it's, it's, a, it's a good thing. So I think uh, more people, more people in time will, will see that. Okay, so why are you at the Free State Project? What do you hope to get out of here? Um, yeah, we're just here to kind of promote Lola Ladies of Liberty Alliance. We are a, we're developing a community of liberty-minded women who need to have on all kinds of issues. Um, represent, we try to build a support network for women that are involved in different forms of activism. From just kind of seeing the calendar highlights a little bit of that. Megan Duffield, ending the Fed, uh, ending the drug war, defending civil liberties. My piece is uh, kind of the anti-war piece. On, um, I, I'm a conscience objector. That's how I got out of the military. I was in the military. Got out as a CEO, and. I'm new to the liberty movement, and it's been really cool to find a, a women's organization to have that support. And we're also here to help educate um, so women can just do better what they're already doing to help give them the skills to Sorry for any figure that out. No, no, no. Kick no, no. ass and take names. No, no, no. Sounds good. Thank you. Uh -huh. How are you doing? So why are you here this weekend? I'm here because the forum will teach me a lot about freedom and because it uh, allows me to join up with many of my friends uh, who are similarly minded in uh, the freedom movement. 
Sounds good. Thank you very much. Thanks. Uh, tell me a little about a little bit about your organization and uh, why you're here at the Free State Project. What do you hope to get out of this weekend? Well, I'm with Gun Owners of America, and uh, we're pretty big. Came here for Liberty supporters. Anywhere, anytime they go anywhere, we go somewhere. Uh, we love the Free State Project. Love the idea, and it goes really in line with our theory, which is zero to, to no regulation at all for guns. Uh, we've been working across the country at the state level trying to get a Freedom of Firearms Act passed, trying to get uh, the state legislatures, the state senates to recognize this idea from the, from the ground up and work that way. We are right out in D.C., so we do a lot of lobbying over there in the terrible Washington, D.C. We have about 300,000 members, and we're hoping to get to a million. Thank you. How's it going? Uh, what do you hope to get out of the Free State Project while you're here? I hope to just you know, hang out and mingle with all of the liberty-minded people, possibly learn a new perspective on different things. Sounds good. Thank you. Hey, so uh, tell me, what is the Free State Project and why are you here? I'm Taryn Lupo with the Low Country Liberty Report. I uh, support the Free State Project from Georgia, and I plan on moving eventually. I think it's, um, I've looked at everything out there, and I, th I think it's the best realistic thing that will actually work. I mean, just with the handful of activists they have already, i have seeing enough positive news come out of here. I know it's where I want to be. Awesome. Thank you. Uh -huh. How's it going? So why are you here at the Free State Project? Well, I'm with Dell Valley Silver. We are an Austrian bartering service. We use free market on the inside. We believe that we want to get silver back into the community, what we consider not fiat money, but real money. Uh, we were at the Freedom last year, and after being here, we decided to start the business to help to end the Fed. Perfect. Thank you very much. So uh, why are you at the Free State Project? Tell me a little about yourself. Well, I joined Free State Project must be like seven years ago, I think, with my family. And we all moved up here four years ago because we were sick of it. We lived in New Jersey, and it was pretty much terrible. So we came up here, loved it ever since. I'm even going to college in New Hampshire, and just love it up here. Are there any uh, people you're really hoping to see, any speakers or any events you're really looking forward to uh, uh, this well, weekend? I'm mostly working the vendor with my dad today, Evan Knappen, and just trying to help promote the program in New Hampshire. Other than that, I will definitely check out some of the speakers, but pretty much I'm going to be in here all day. All right, thank you.